Hey dudes and welcome back to How to Successfully Fail at Psychonauts, episode 5, part 7. I did not expect to go to a part 7 in this episode, but it does seem awfully near the end, so why not? I'm enjoying it, so let's let's get it done. It does seem like it's within reach now, within grasp. You join me in the middle of a boss fight, like literally in the middle of a boss fight. I pressed escape, in the middle of a boss fight, we are still in the middle of a boss fight. And Tim Curry will not like that I made him wait five minutes. Shit, see, he's not happy. Whoa, whoa, what happened there? Something happened and he, he got his cleaver stuck. Let's keep going away from him. Now, confusion nades don't seem like they're going to be pretty helpful and they don't seem to be replenishing. So, it does not seem the case that is required. Maybe TK? Put that on Q. Still don't seem to be able to hurt him. Mm. Maybe... Pyrokinesis? Not right now. Oh shit, I went running. Uh, flying even. Let's keep him out of range. He seems to get his cleaver stuck from time to time. Not now, but soon. Oh, flying. Oh wow, I've got one merit on me. Oh no, I tell a light. I'm dead. Right, here we go. So, what are we going to do to get this guy down? Come here, bunny. How about you get your cleaver stuck again? And I'll try pyrokinesis. It doesn't seem like that's going to work, though. Bun, bun, bun. <laughs> Shield's definitely working out pretty uh, well for me. <laughs> Hmm. Buddy, buddy, buddy. How did they get it stuck? Hmm. He definitely got it stuck, but how did I trigger that? <laughs> what? He ran and booted me? Hmm. Watch out for that fucking running boot. Hmm. Right now. Try pyrokinesis. No, it doesn't seem to be working. Too cold. No, it just won't get any warmer either. Okay, so that didn't seem to work. You'd think. Uh, I don't know. I think clairvoyance is gonna work. Come here, buddy. Just sees me as me. Hmm. <laughs> oh, okay. Do not walk over the grinder in the middle. That will not end well. I did suspect this, but still, thought it was worth a try. Oh, fuck me. Right. So T. Um. I don't know. It's invisibility. Maybe levitate onto his- uh, yeah, maybe jump onto his head and you can do something. Alright. Oh, excuse me now. I don't know how you trigger him getting stuck. It just seems to randomly get it stuck when he cleaves for you. Uh, anyway, let's just keep doing what we were doing before and maybe I'll spot the pattern. Come here. Right, just keep doing what we're doing. What? I shielded that? Got plenty of shield. Doesn't seem like it's ever going to wear off or not for as long as I'm using it anyway. No, that doesn't work. Shield's 
shit, I'm stuck here. Ah. Oh. Yeah. Right, love it to it. He does something with that, but I don't know what. Just don't know. Well, either way, Levitate seems to be getting me away quite nicely. Apart from Len. Right, so he got it stuck again. Just don't know. Right, just keep running and jumping. Like that. Ah. Gotta watch out for the overswing. I'm not gonna hurt you. There's gotta be some something that you can do to him. Just I can't figure out what. None of my powers seem to work. Oh, I see, the first. Okay, just need to run up his arm, right. In which case, I'm better actually just doing what I was doing before. Stay closer to him and keep using shield. I was thinking, like, you know, maybe if, I, I like how fucking Ford gave me a hint after fucking, you know, being on the air for like, it must say, like, if you've been on air for like five minutes and you've not hurt him, let's give you a hint. But usually the face is quite vulnerable. I couldn't figure out how to get up there reliably or like, how to hit him, but I guess just run up nice and, like I said, don't overthink it, just run up the arm. Punch him in the face or something. What's a ghost all on about shit? Come on, get your cleaver stuck again, then. Connie mother fork. Is there, is there a way to trigger him to do it? Apart from it didn't work. Next time his cleaver gets stuck in the ground, running up his arm and punch him in his fat head. Which is exactly what I did. I ran up his arm, I punched him in his fat fucking head. Try it again next time. But that's what I did. Come on, motherfucker. Next time his cleaver gets stuck in the ground, run up his arm and punch him in his fat head. Oh, and then he can slip off right fucking easy. Oh my god, it's alright. I just need to hit him once so I know what the deal is. Can you shoot him in his fat fucking face? That'd be much easier for me. I've said this has to be the longest time I've ever been on a boss without actually dying. That might have actually got stuck if I hadn't have um, shielded it. Just running backwards while fucking smoking me, Sig. That'd have been good, that, but... That was a nice evade there. Come here, bunny. To make sure I don't shield his fucking... his down chop. Next like that. It just... It just makes you slip off, and then when... It makes you slip off. And it's not right obvious where you hit him. I mean, it's his head and it's massive, but yeah, it doesn't seem to be doing it. Doesn't seem to be doing it. Right, foot the side swings, we can shield them. And that one way does a double overhead, that's no use either. So as soon as he doesn't no, no, that, ah, oh, fuck. Right, wait for the single overhead. Like that, unfortunately, it actually hit me and it fucking raped. Ugh. 
I should do it in once so I know, you know, what the rough deal is, and then I'll be able to fucking copy it for the next yeah. hour minutes it takes to kill him. Not a double. That's what I wanted. It just... It, you tr do you know what? Really fucking annoying. You try... You fucking focus his head. You know, you press shift to lock onto his head. It just swings the camera around and then it makes you fall off. I need to shield that. And that. Next time his cleaver gets stuck in the ground, run up his arm and punch him in his fat head. Oh for fuck! Come on! Double. I'm not gonna hurt you. Come on. Do a single overhead. Single overhead. There we go. Yeah, for the know. Oh, just... I was doing that every single fucking time. But I don't think you need to lock on. If you lock on, it just throws the camera really fucking horrid. You just fly off, so... The lock on mechanic's fucking useless when you're up there. Right, we know his patterns and stuff, though. Wait for the single overhead. That's the one. Oh, it hit me though. Damn it. Come on, do it again, motherfuck. That's double. Which rarely ever hits me, actually. It's his right arm. Just raises up, and then I just need to dodge to the right or to the left or to the anywhere, really. Like that. There we go. It's no. Oh, that works now as well. I've done that before. The um, the down attack. I've done that many a times. Hey, it's fucking easy now. So I mean, all I had to do is hit him once, and that involved releasing lock and stuff like that, and not sliding off. Oh shit! Booted me. Come here, little bunny. Come on. Your right arm overhead. No, that's the wrong one. It's a cleave. That's the one we wanted. Eat shit. Fucker. In right in your ear as well, I could death from that. Wee! What's he doing? Just throwing shit out of the window? Where are we now? Who's that? On here. What have you done to our circus? Did you just want eight to? Dad! Polluted. Perverted. This looks like the work of mentalists. I can explain. Have you been associating with psychics? Dad, I. Psychics. Fortune tellers. They killed your grandfather. They cursed our entire family to die in water! Yes, but- Including you, Rasputin! And me! But I'm going to live! You know why? Because I'm still an acrobat! Let's see if you are! So you had to fight Oleander's dad, even though he didn't actually kill him, and then fight Raz's dad. Water? Or show me what you got! Yes, yes, very well. You can do that as well. I can do that as well. Great. Oh, how very fancy. I don't think I can do cartwheels on a tightrope, though. That is quite nifty. And juggling spiky bowling pins. Cool. Sure, he's going to throw some of those spiky bowling pins at me. Don't drown. Well, I'll try. Where are we now? Oof, only just. Whoa! Oof. No. Where are we going now then? 
Onto here, I guess. Onto that. Swing back. Swing forward. There we go. Jump up. Oh, basic braining coming handy again. Jump up. Right. Onto that. Let's run straight forward, eh? Oh, now you're going to shoot him low. Now I'm gonna, oh, um. Oh my god! Oh my god! Drowned? Over here. <laughs> oh fucking hell, they were rapid fire. Right, so you jump onto here. How do you get the fuck around? Just curl around here, go down maybe. Curl around- Oh, come on! It wants you to do some wobbly shit. The game should know what 3D platform is fucking like. That is way wobbly for a 3D platformer. Curl around? Well, yeah, it'd be a lot easier if it wasn't for the fucking camera. Oh, nice to go over there without getting it this time. It's actually want me to do this, like, curl around? Seems to, but it's really wobbly. Oh, uh, and then you single jump off and it just drops you onto the floor. Of course! Of course. You don't get no double jump from that, do you? How are you supposed to get around, then? Is it always the same pattern here? Oh, f fucker. Doesn't seem like I could jump over to him, because as soon as I jump over to him, he's just going to raise up higher in a Yeah, he's following me, following me. So what if... I Fucking hell! It's entirely on weird fucking cameras and shit like that. Bloody hell. Ah. You know what? I'm just gonna fucking. Oh, for fuck. I'm gonna say absolutely fuck off to that. I'm glad you don't lose lives for it anyway, but I'm just gonna say balls to it, you know? Absolute balls to it. And I'm just gonna jump onto the actual top rail proper fucking exploit the shit out of it. I knew he'd do that fucking... <sighs> Let's try to jump up. Like that. The camera's fighting me! I can't turn the camera in the direction that I want to go. That is so fucking annoying. What's the point of letting you turn the camera if it's going to auto-force its own turn? Nice. Maybe I can just not even, like, remotely turn and it'll just auto-curl me around. I don't know. Bloody cameras in 3D platformers, man. Over. Under. Let's try do it legitimately, because seriously, that camera is just fighting me so hard. I'm just going to hold left. And you jump, and you don't get a double jump, and you can't reach there, so what the fuck are you supposed to do? If you can't double jump off, you can't reach it with a single jump, so what the fuck are you supposed to do? Hey. Ah. Uh, over? Under? Yeah. I just don't understand this, you can't get... If you press F, you can't do no. And now I'm on the other side, which is really wobbly. You just don't get... 
Sometimes you jump off it, like you saw, I got to the other side of it, it let me double jump then. Then I jump off it, trying to do it properly, you don't get a double jump. What is with the randomness of it? Don't jump. What is with the randomness of it? Does it want me to fucking jump off? Does it only want me to single jump? You can't do it with a single jump. Look, if I jump here, I can double jump again. Apart from not that time. And not that time. What the fuck? Oh, and now it lets you double jump. What is the deal? What? What the fuck? I was gonna fucking kill this game. What is the fucking point of having it so random shit like that? What is the fucking point? Did nobody fucking test this? Jump off once. Yeah, you can double jump now. Jump off another time. No, you can't double jump now. I'm sorry. Don't be sorry. Make it fucking you know, predictable what you can do. Jump. Jump. Ah, I see. That's f oh, only just though, but that was fine. Now, you're, not gonna, you're gonna fuck me over again, aren't you? Oh, not that time. Not that time. Okay, but now I'm on the other side of the fence. So the camera's fighting me like a bitch. Right. Oh my god. If it's not a random double jump, it's a fucking shit camera angle. Come on, seriously. It's not difficult. It's fucking stupid and random. Well, it's not even random, it's just fucking, you know, I wouldn't even call it random, I'd, I'd call it bugged. <sighs> and I have no confidence in that double jump now. I have no confidence in that double jump. I have no confidence that the double jump's gonna come out when I want it, and even if it does, I might miss it because of the fucking camera. Right, let's try again. Jump, jump. Okay, so you gotta jump and then you gotta push in. Right, okay. I'm having a double jump early though, just so it do not God, finally. Fucking really weird. And then, and then it just doesn't double jump. You go all that way, you seem to have got the fucking weird thing that it wants. And then all of a sudden, it seems like probably on the last bit, it goes, nah, no double jump now. No double jump. Bloody hell. Frustrating bit here. Oh my god. <sighs> I don't mind shit being hard. You know me guys, I'll play fucking any hard game under the sun, I don't care. But this isn't hard, that's what's annoying. It's just a shit camera angle and a random fucking double jump that's failing me. And if you don't have confidence in the double jump, you can't do it right. And then you... T I was holding... I I've still got my finger on W. Look, I've, I've, I, I didn't take my finger off W the entire time there. I was holding into that fence. But did it grab the fence? No. So you've either got a shit camera angle, a failing double jump, or... What was the other thing now? Oh, yeah. Or, or you don't grab all the fence like when you think you would do. Look at the camera then! Proper trying to sabotage! Hold the fucking fence! Oh yeah, I know you can't really catch those, I was just testing you. It would have been fine if I had heard it like 40 times already. Purely down to shit fucking bit here. Say there you go, when I actually managed to grab hold of the fucking fence. There's plenty of time. I'm going right to the top here. And the double jump doesn't come out. I 
apologise, guys, for the repetition of this. This is not on me. And we're gonna go into another fucking part now. Really fucking odge bodge. Fuck me. And the double jump fails again! Come on! I don't mind games being hard. I do not like games being shit. This game isn't shit. This game is fucking fantastic. But the bit stupid bits like this. Oh. Oh, I thought it spawned me underwater then. But say, well, that would actually have been a refreshing change. I wouldn't have minded that. Give me something else to complain about other than shit camera angles, the inability to double jump when required, and even if you do double jump, you might not grab the fence. Wait, is this part of the difficulty? Because it shouldn't be. It, look at the camera then, it almost made me fall off the pot chop. Right. Jump. Jump! Hold the. Oh. Oh my god. Serious, serious, serious relief when this area is done, man. I'm sick of this bit. It wasn't even that fun to begin with, this area. The sheer fact that it's absolutely just delaying me for no reason at all other than sheer. It's going to eventually drop me off that and it's going to add yet another thing for me to complain about. It's going to drop me off that fucking porch up eventually. They should have known the limits of 3D platforming in regards to doing something like that. They'll have tested it. They'll have seen people doing that. Why is it still in? I'm not saying they should patch it now. You know, it's a bit fucking late now, like, but, you know, on release. They probably just went, oh, well, you know, it's the end of the game. It's supposed to be hard. It's like, no, it's not hard. It's fucking stupid. There's a big difference between difficulty and just outright unintuitive shit. You're fighting the camera angles, you're fighting the double jump, you're fighting whether you're going to connect to the fence or not, you might connect to the wrong side of the fence, and then you are fucked because the camera is going to fuck you even harder. Really don't like this bit, gotta be honest. Really don't like it. It's not hard. That's what's the frust- I, I keep saying it, that's the frustrating part of this bit. It's not hard. Well, it wouldn't be Ace's death without a little bit of rage, but I didn't expect it. You know, after the fucking safe fucking debacle and shit like that, and having to grind for shit, you know, I thought that was just a little bit of bleating, but this is absolute fury. Oh my god, that massive height of the double jump there. Oh, 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 oh we got to the third bit. We haven't done it yet, but we got to the fucking third bit. You know what's incoming? My fucking fist! Seriously. It needs to, it, I need to get past this fucking bit. Because I need to, I, I've got about a few minutes, maybe more. I'm gonna lose fucking life for this now. Thanks, I did actually want to jump, but as always, fighting fucking cameras and other shit. At least you just leave me to my own camera, but you can't get left to your own camera because, the, you know, oh, well, you know, that'd be, it'd be too unintuitive if you controlled your own camera. Won it! Incoming. Oof. No, don't control your own camera. We can't trust the player to control his own shit. I feel almost insulted, actually. Because apparently, you know, controlling the camera is beyond me. But, you know, fighting a camera, fucking hell, fighting the auto camera, 
around the fucking curling thing where the double jump doesn't work, where you can't connect to the fence all the fucking time. You might have ended up on the other side of the fence and a million other fucking wacky fucking shit things. Like that time! I would almost, you know, if I'd have fallen there, I would have almost agreed with it. I didn't actually connect to the fence. Other times, I have been definitely... SHUT THE FUCK UP! Rasputin all the fucking time, man! They, don't, they haven't even referenced why there's those spirits there, what those spirits are, and why they're always shouting my fucking name! No, FUCK THE CAMERA ANGLE! I bet you a tenner, I got to the last bit. That furthest time I've got along here? Oh, oh. The furthest p way I've got along here so far, yeah, I bet you a tenner there's only one more jump and that's it. There's like five bits in there. I think I got through four of them. I bet there's one last one and that's it. Dun -dun 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 You've done it. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Fuck off. Yeah, a little help. A little help, please. I'd like a patch. No, you can't really patch those. That's just double fine, trolling the fuck out of me! Stop it. Look! I'm on the third one, there's a fourth, the fifth, and that's it. Let me onto the fourth. Double jump! Double verge! Oh, fuck! Fuck! Shit the bastard! Fuck! Rasputin! Rasputin! Fuck! Jump, run underneath, jump, get fucked over by the camera angle, jump, we're going to run over here. Now, we have the option, do we not connect to the fence or do we not double jump? Okay, right, okay, now we've got the same options again. What we're gonna, what's going to happen this time? Oh, we connected to the fence, oh, this is very, very, very good. Yes, okay, cool, that's okay. Right, now we're going to jump to the next one, what's this going to do? Oh, we connected to it again, okay, cool, this is alright. Okay, right, now we're going to go through the fire and we're going to get to the right side. Now what's going to happen now, we're going to double jump fail. No, we got the double jump. We just can't connect to the. F we just can't connect to the fence. We just can't connect to it. It's just impossible. It's just impossible. And Claire's a pizza, and it smells nice, and I'm getting all fucking hungry, and I'm getting fucking pissed. I used to like. Fuck off. Dump. Oh my god, that just was done all wrong. All wrong. This better not boot me out. If it boots me out, it better put me back here. Right. Okay. Yes. Do it again. Yes. Okay. Okay. This is all. This is this is going fine so far. Okay. Yes. Yes. I, I accept how far we've got so far. This is okay. Mm -hmm. No worries. And then the camera curls around the first three platforms, then goes. Well, the fourth. We well, don't really need the camera to carry on doing what we was doing before, do you? You know, you jump off the fence and you go flying and the camera doesn't curl you around or anything like that. Because you don't really need the camera to carry on doing what it's done for two f uh, f for 60% um, of this so far. Hmm. Jump over here. Oh, no, no. Oh, well, we ain't had a double jump fail in a while. I can tolerate that. I can tolerate that. We ain't had a double jump fail. Fuck off! We ain't had a double jump fail in a while, so... Oh, tight rope, seriously, man, don't delay me. I'm really fucking sick of jumping up these fucking ropes, man. Seriously, I'm gonna fucking strangle myself on these ropes in a minute. I'm seriously just gonna go, I've had enough. Game over, man, game over. I'm just gonna fucking seriously just hang myself off the tight rope. Circus style suicide, man, seriously. Oh my god, just seriously fuck yourself in your own ass. I don't know how you're gonna manage that, but shit, I watched Wishmaster 2 or something like that years back and they managed to do it in that. So I assume it's possible. At least in a, um, a fictional sense, so there, yeah. I can't remember which Wishmaster it was. Was it 1, was it 2? I just don't give a fuck. But yeah, if you ever want to see a guy um, fuck himself in his own ass, watch through the Wishmasters until you see a guy fuck himself in his own ass. I shit you not, by the way. I, I, I actually, I'm actually not joking, by the way. 
Oh my god, I'm gonna fuck myself in my own ass in a minute, seriously. It seems like that would be more possible than this area. Come on! Seriously! I, I, I know! It's, it, you've gone over a bit of a half an hour here, OTG. I know! I want this bit done! I am going to get to the end of this bit in this part. It is going to happen. And when it. Fuck it! No, it's not! You know what? I'll see you next part. <laughs>